welcome to another gaming video. Uh, I'll be doing these from now on. Also, new thing, you're going to be getting a lot more plush videos from now on as well. But uh, as we all know, the hunt is going on and it's ending today. Uh, I think I'll make a review video of the other thing I got from the hunt. I'm currently wearing it. If you can't tell, you can't tell, but... So basically, I really did want, like, a good video on TDS's hunt, because honestly, like, the last one, the audio glitched, and then the in-game audio started playing, and then that was all goofy, and I did not like it, so hopefully, yeah, this one does not have any audio. Uh, the event is really easy, and it makes sense, because, like, you know, they give you the tower, they give you, like, towers, because, I'm like, this event, like, just in case, like, new people are playing, it's just so, like, uh, the new people can just get through this and then, you know, be done with it, essentially. Uh, if you don't know, this was my, uh, gameplay strategy that I'm using for the last video I made, believe it or not. It's not a good strategy, but it got me through the hunt. Oh yeah, I beat this first try pretty easily. Like, I know why, you know, Roblox did this. It's just so when new players come, they can honestly just get through this so they can just be done, move on to the next game. And this reminds me of the 2020 uh, egg hunt from TDS. This reminds me of that because there was only like 10 waves and, was, and they gave you like the towers you would need to kind of beat them essentially, to beat like the egg hunt, I'm pretty sure, something like that. I'm pretty sure that's how it worked. And I guess that's what they're doing right now. And I'm kind of glad they stuck to that because it was easy to... The recording kind of stopped for a second. So as you can tell, this is a new game. I kept my strategy. Uh, basically, I don't know what happened to the recording, but it just paused, it froze. So I had to join a new game. But uh, basically, I wanted like a good, like the last video I made, sure, I did do it about the hunt. Uh, but the thing is, it wasn't like a good video, so like, because I want you guys to kind of like hear my voice. And as you guys, maybe if you're a TDS player, as you can see, as uh, waves progress, the map becomes like more distorted and stuff, I guess which is kind of a cool feature, I'll be honest. This is a Corblox warrior. I think he's supposed to be like the normal bosses that would that you would usually get. That's odd, I don't recognize the armor on that enemy. Or I mean I do. Is that the knight from the red cliff? What is he doing on their side? I think that's like the speedy boss or something. A uh, red cliff traitor. He betrayed the Red Cliffs. Uh, yeah, as you can see, pieces are just flying up in the air, I guess. And, uh, I think I'll be doing more TDS videos because they're pretty easy to make. It's just, you know, do TDS. I love playing TDS. Uh, I think I'll upload another TDS video today if I can. Uh, the event is like super easy because you just get a bunch of money per wave, honestly. So like, this couldn't be easier. Oh shoot, it has 70 health. Let's try, let's try. Let's at least. We got him down to 28, that's actually not too bad. Let's throw in a few more mini gunners because we probably need it. As you can see, another Red Cliff boss that we have here. Oh, he gets obliterated. These 
core block souls are also getting obl obliterated. I don't know if I was gonna say a blah, 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 if I was gonna say something like that. Oh, uh, the event is pretty easy, like I said. Uh, we're almost done with it. There's like 10 waves, pretty much. This is easy. Hanging in there. Hanging in there. I have a feeling we haven't seen the worst of it. Look, alive. They're preparing a big push. As you can see, there's a bunch of enemies, but we could probably kill them easily. We're going to add a few more wardens back here. Just for fun, just for that fun stuff, just in case. Uh, let's place down another mini gunner here, cause that'll probably be good. I just place just a million mini gunners, and yeah, that's how I won. Uh, stunning blows. Let's upgrade these wardens so they have stunning blows, cause that'll probably be good. Uh. Red Cliff Giant, I mean, Traitor. Oh man, look at that. That looked like a snake. All right, and here's our Core Blocks General. As you can see, the map is very disordered now. Wave 10 is just gonna be more disordered and we'll see the boss. And you know, I gotta be excited about it, so woohoo. Uh, upgrade these mini gunners. Is that a death walker I see coming? I thought those were just a myth. We haven't seen anything like it. Be ready for anything. Commander is literally the freaking protagonist of TDS. It's always helping me and stuff. A mini gunner at the edge here. Oh, uh, let's get this guy so we have stone blows. Uh, the Wardens are pretty OP in this. If you don't know what the Warden is, you can get it from the Pizza Party thing. But you have to buy it. So, yeah. Corblock's Death Walker. This Death Walker is literally just has the exact health of the normal zombie. And look at him. He, he is already... Yeah, he's dead. He, like, he's deader than dead. Okay, you stun those guys. That was kind of just a waste of time. Let's place down a few mini gunners. And place down another. This guy. Uh, I guess we'll place down a few more soldiers. And he's dead. He, he's gone, dude. Oh, yeah. Like, I barely use the trapper. I normally place 40 troops. Well,. He's dead. And look at his cool death animation. And he's dead. Well, uh, let's wait for us to get rewarded. Oh yeah, the house looks like this. I don't know why. Wave reward. Triumph, Egghead 2024. Uh, thank you for watching the video. I hope to see you in another one, hopefully. Uh, yeah, goodbye.